Okay class, today what we're going to be doing is taking our 30-day Instagram challenge pictures and creating a collage. So basically layering multiple, in this case 30, pictures on top of our artboard. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to File, Open, and I'm going to open my example. Now you're going to have to download this from Schoology, but at least you have something to start with. So here's my example, and as you can see, I've used um, guidelines in my rulers to give you a grid, so you know exactly where your 30 pictures are going to go, and they should go in order. One, two, three, four, five, six, by the day. So I'm going to go to File, Open, and now I'm going to bring in my pictures. So I'm just going to bring in a couple at a time. So I'm going to grab just these six. Okay, and they're going to open up on the tabs up here on the top. Now, I downloaded these from my Instagram folder in, through my phone. If your pictures are not square, what you're going to end up having to do is crop them to be square. So let's talk about cropping. So this is your cropping tool right here. You're going to click on it, and you can change the ratio up here to square, which is a one-to-one. -one. And as you can see, mine fits. If I wanted to change it, I would just simply pull in and out and move my picture around. So if I wanted to crop an area in or out, so this is what I want. So I'm going to press Enter. Okay, then I'm going to go up here to select, actually I'm not. Okay, I can do select all. Okay, I had to turn off the lock because I realized my layer was locked. So I'm going to select all. The other way you can select all is using a rectangle marquee tool and just coming across the whole picture and pressing select. Then I'm going to press control C or edit copy. So if you look at copy, it says control C. That's your shortcut key. So it's just as easy to go control C to copy. And then I'm going to go into my photo challenge and do control V. Now, as you can see, it's really, really big, and we don't want that. So we're going to go to Image, sorry, Edit, Free Transform, or Control-T. Now, when you do this, it's important to hold Shift to constrain your proportions. And then you're just going to hold Shift and pull from one of the corners until it is the size you want. As you can see, I'm getting closer. Okay, then I want to say that that day is day three for something old. So I'm just going to stick it right into that box. And I'm going to make sure that all of my edges are covered. There's no white showing. So I could even zoom in for this and just take a quick look. You notice how it's blurry? Well, as soon as I press enter, that blurriness is going to go away. So I'm going to zoom out. And I'm going to go on to my next picture. So the same thing. Select all. Edit copy. Edit paste. Control T. I'm holding shift so I can strain proportions. And throw it up in that corner. And I'm just going to do my quick zoom in to double check. As you can see, I kind of missed a little on this box, so I'm going to pull it out. Okay, I'm good. I'm going to press enter. So that was my first day. That was self-portrait. And I'm just going to keep going until I have all 30. Now, once you get a few done, what I recommend is go to File, Save As. And you're saving it as a PSD file, your last name. and save. When you go to turn it in, you're going to have to save it once as a PSD and then once as a JPEG and you'll turn both of those into me. Hopefully that helps. Um, you're going to end up with all of these layers here and you can feel free to label what day they are too um, or you could just go in order, you know, one, two, three, four. Um, there won't be any overlapping so you shouldn't have to worry about that. Basically you're just taking your pictures, copying them out of the one, so select, control C, control V as in victory, control T as in Tom. Okay, and then you're going to be putting it into the appropriate box.
oh no. And we're just going to fix that. Press enter. And remember too, you can zoom in to double check. Okay guys, if you have any questions, just let me know.